Isaiah chapter 60 Arise, shine, for your light hath come, and the glory of the Lord hath risen upon you. For behold, darkness will cover the earth, and deep darkness the peoples. But the Lord will rise upon you, and his glory will appear upon you. And nations will come to your light, and kings to the brightness of your rising. Lift up your eyes round about, and see, they all gather together, they come to you. Your sons will come from afar, and your daughters will be carried in the arms. Then you will see and be radiant, and your heart will thrill and rejoice, because the abundance of the sea will be turned to you. The wealth of the nations will come to you. A multitude of camels will cover you. The young camels of Midian and Ephah. All those from Sheba will come. They will bring gold and frankincense and will bear good news of the praises of the Lord. And the flocks of Kedar will be gathered together to you. The rams of Naboth will minister to you. They will go up with acceptance on my altar, and I shall glorify my glorious house. Who are these who fly like a cloud, and like the doves to their lattices? Surely the coastland will wait for me, and the ships of Tarshish will come first, to bring your sons from afar, their silver and their gold with them, for the name of the Lord your God and the Holy One of Israel, because He has glorified you. And foreigners will build up your walls, and their kings will minister to you. For in my wrath I struck you, and in my favor I have had compassion on you. And your gates will be opened continually. They will not be closed day or night, so that men may bring you to the wealth of the nations, with their kings led in procession. For the nation and the kingdom which will not serve you will perish, and the nations will be utterly ruined. The glory of Lebanon will come to you. The juniper, the box tree, and the cypress together to beautify the place of my sanctuary. And I shall make the place of my feet glorious, and the sons of those who afflicted you will come bowing to you, and all those who despised you will bow themselves at the soles of your feet, and they will call you the city of the Lord, the Zion of the Holy One of Israel, whereas you have been forsaken and hated with no one passing through. I will make you an everlasting pride a joy from generation to generation. You will also suck the milk of nations and will suck the breast of kings. Then you will know that I, the Lord, am your Savior and your Redeemer, the Mighty One of Jacob. Instead of bronze, I will bring gold, and instead of iron, I bring silver. Instead of wood, bronze, and instead of stones, iron, and I will make peace your administrators, and your righteousness your overseers. Violence will not be heard again in your land, nor devastation or destruction within your borders, but you will call your walls salvation, and your gates praise. No longer will you have the sun for light by day, nor for brightness will the moon give you light, but you will have the Lord for an everlasting light, and your God for your glory. Your sun will set no more, neither will your moon wane, for you will have the Lord for an everlasting light, and the days of your mourning will be finished. Then all your people will be righteous. They will possess the land forever. The branch of my planting, the work of my hands, that I may be glorified. The smallest one will become a clan, 
and the least one a mighty nation. I, the Lord, will hasten it in its time. Chapter 60, Isaiah.